Helmet, red steel. Saw sword, red steel. Saw swords are used by the Tevinter Imperium. Documents and the heroine is leveled up. Okay. Oh, what were we gonna do? There we go, I like that. Yeah. And then device mastery, yeah. That's device mastery. No, pile of filth. It is begun. Or silver and a pile of filth. Glass phylactery. All right. Well, you know, it's it's been a little while since we uh, opened up a glass phylactery. So let's do another one. The area is unnaturally cold. Dark shapes swirl around a slip of paper within the vial. Take the vial. Glass fractures at your touch. Oh! Revenant. You might resist anything I try to do. Do that. that. Kill the reverend. When kill the remnant. Scrap of paper. Codex updated. I can't believe we took him down so I can't believe that. I don't think I've ever taken down a revenant that fast on any setting.
Oh, let's go get that one chest that I couldn't do. I think I can get it now. I just... Oh. Well. Uh. I think it was... Oh, oh no, really? What was that? I thought maybe it was another wolf. Alright, so where was the... What? Uh... Where's the water? Came up through a pool of water. I went swimming. And I don't see it now. I don't know. All right. Okay, let's go get Zathrian now. Excuse me, pardon me, pardon me, excuse me. According to the Chantry calendar, every hundred years is an age. Aimed at the end of the last age, according to Omens, to stern that year. Like this one was named Dragon Age because dragons have been seen for the first time in centuries. Well, 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 it's Zathrian. What's he doing here? And here you are already. Yes. What are you doing here? You have carved a safe path through the forest. Safe enough for me to follow, anyhow. There was no way to tell what would happen once you reached this ruin, so I decided to come myself. We need to talk, you and I. Yes, yes, there will be plenty of time for that. Did you acquire the heart? No, I didn't. You didn't? May I ask then, why are you leaving the ruin? You knew about... The lady won't summon Witherfang until you break the curse. You do understand that she actually is Witherfang? I thought as much. She is the powerful spirit of this ancient forest that I summoned long ago and bound in the body of the wolf. Her nature is that of the forest itself. Beautiful and terrible. Serene and savage. Maiden and beast. She is the Lady and Witherfang both, two sides of a single being. The curse came first from her. Those she afflicted with it mirrored her own nature, becoming savage beast as well as human. The werewolves? Ah. The curse came first from you. They attacked my clan, and they were the same savages then that they have ever been. They deserve to be wiped out and not defended. Come, I will accompany you back to the ruin. Let us go and speak to the spirit, and I will force her into Witherfang's form. He may then be slain and the heart taken.
I assure you, the werewolves have regained their mind. Even so, they are still the same worthless creatures that their ancestors were. They deserve nothing more than the misery they possess. This is not your battle, Grey Warden. Let us just take the heart and be done with it. They have so much hatred after all this time. You were not there. You did not see what, what, what they did to my son, to my daughter, and so many others. You are not Dalish. How can you know how we had to struggle to be safe? How could I have let their crimes go unanswered? But those crimes were committed centuries ago. I remember them as if it were yesterday. Even if they are more than animals now, they desire nothing but revenge. They will never let my clan be. So your answer is to let them suffer forever? Tell me, if you held your own daughter's lifeless body in your arms, would you not also have sworn an eternity of pain on those who did such to her? I might have, but who's being punished now? Very well. You wish me to go and talk? I will do so. But what if it is only more revenge they wish? Will you safeguard me from harm? I will. I will, unless you attack first. I fail to see the purpose behind this, but... Very well. It has been many centuries now. Let us see what the spirit has to say. So here you are, spirit. <sighs> she is the lady of the forest! You will address her properly! You've taken a name, spirit? And you've given names to your pets? These beasts who follow you? It, it was they who gave me a name, Zathrian. And the names they take are their own. They follow me because I help them to find who they are. Who they are has not changed from whom their ancestors were. Wild savages, worthless dogs. Their twisted shape only mirrors their monstrous hearts. He will not help us, lady. It is as I warned you. He is not here to talk. No, I am here to talk, though I see little point in it. We all know where this will lead. Your nature compels it, as does mine. It does not have to be that way. There is room in your heart for compassion, Zathrian. Surely your retribution is spent. My retribution is eternal, spirit. As is my pain. This is justice, no more. Are you certain your pain is the only reason you will not end this curse? Have you told the mortal how it was created? And so he did. Witherfang and I are bound as one being. But such powerful magic could not be accomplished without Zathrian's own blood. Your people believe you have rediscovered the immortality of their ancestors, Zathrian. But that is not true. So long as the curse exists, so do you. But man. No! That is not how it is! used blood magic to send this curse. So he's bound to the spirit of the forest. And she's bound to the curse. Bound to these that are cursed. I did it for my people. I did it for my son and my daughter. For them, for justice, I would do anything. The curse would not end with Zathrian's death. His life, however, relies on its existence. And I believe his death plays a part in its ending. Then we kill him! 